such this. Happy Softball Sunday, folks. I hope you're all doing great. This is going to be super quick to teach you how to play MC Hammers Can't Touch This, so I think I'll kick off the proceedings with a little joke. Have I told you about my friend, Mr. Pumpkin? He's a curious gourd with a strange affinity for bugs, so if he ever invites you over to his house and you see a spider, you butternut squash it. All righty, can't touch this for the campfire. Give me a D, but I don't care about the baby E string. Leave that open. Now, your middle finger is going to migrate to the A string third fret, and you're going to lose your pointer finger. A string second fret. A power chord, meaning I don't want to hear the B string in this A chord. All right, so far, D with no middle finger. A string, three, two, A power chord. Then form your G chord but lose your middle finger because we want to hear that open E string and then put it back. Then lose your middle finger again and mute your low E string. We want to hear that B note on the A string second fret to our A power chord. Let's talk about the muting thing. I'm gonna use my thumb to mute. Listen, when you play G normally, the lowest note is a G, the E string third fret. You don't say G with a G in the bass, that would be redundant. Saying G implies that there is a G in the bass. So if we put something else in the bass by, for instance, muting the low E string, our lowest note now is the A string second fret, a B note, so we have to say G with a B in the bass that is written G slash B and pronounced G with a B in the bass. So I'm just going to let my thumb kind of flop over there, you know, like your guitar teacher told you not to. I'm just going to let it flop in that way. The E string's not going to make any noise and I can just strum away without worrying about hearing a note I don't want to hear. And that's it. That's how you do that for your campfire. Thank you so much for being here. I hope that was fun and helpful, and I will see you next time with more stuff. Goodbye.